this is Chris the Nightmare Ariola, and you're watching Mission Boxing Today on YouTube. Heavyweight boxing fans, what's the deal? So this fight happened a few days ago out there in Atlantic City. Darmani Rock improves the 7-0. Fifth round KO of Solomon May. I didn't get to see the fight, but from what I'm hearing, I tried to look for it. I couldn't find it, man. When do you guys find it? Um, please leave it in the um, comment section. But from what I'm hearing... Darmani Rock controlled the first few rounds with his jab. He was setting up uh, all his power shots with the jab. Um, hurting May with some hard shots. And then the uh, combination that finished it was a right hand left foot combination. And I heard May was knocked out cold before he actually hit the canvas. So, uh, you know, Darmani Rock did what he was supposed to do. Um, still young, still learning. I believe he's just turned 20 or he's around or yeah, he's 20 years old. Um signed when he was uh with rock nation he was 19 so still learning picked up a victory did what he was supposed to do and i will be keeping an eye out on rock this year uh with some other prospects because some of the other prospects are working their way into the uh you know sanctioning bodies and starting to be rated um guys like you know gerald washington and jarell miller and huey fury and Trevor Bryan, Israel Ganu, Adrian Gernot, you know, Michio Wallace, Tom Schwartz, Ajay Kabayel, like guys like that. They're, you know, kind of moving, trying to get in that contender, you know, that contender area as far as the heavyweight division. So I think those guys have separated themselves from some of the other up and coming prospects, guys that don't have as many fights. Some of these other dudes have, you know, 10 or less fights. Some of them are around the 13, 14 and no mark. But they're still, you know, trying to get their names out there. Um, and I think Rock is in that that um in the group of, you know, those type of prospects. The guys like the uh Nathan Gormans and Adam Konaskis and you know uh, Alexander Teslinko and Otto Wallen, Cassius Cheney, Junior Fa, um Trey Lippy Morrison, although Morrison did just beat Lattimore, who was another undefeated, uh, undefeated prospect, Ed Lattimore handed him his first loss. But, um, you know, <clears throat> I'm going to be looking out for those guys. There's some other ones too, man. Uh, Nick Webb out there in the UK. Um, I don't want to get a start naming them all, man. Sean Turner. I mean, there's a lot of them. I'm going to keep my eyes out on a lot of these guys this year, man. But, uh, Darmani Rock is definitely one of them high on the list for me to check out and see what, you know, how he progresses in his career. David Hay and Schaefer just uh, signed Tony Yoka and Frank Warren signed uh, Daniel Dubois. So there's a lot going on right now, man. A lot of young up and coming talent coming up, getting signed. So Darmani Rock is definitely one of the guys I'm going to keep my eye on. If you guys seen this fight, man, or got a link to it or some, you know, some type of clip of it, please send it to me. But I'm just getting it out there that uh, Darmani Rock did improve to 7-0 a few days ago out there in Atlantic City with a crushing knockout victory. Let me know what you think in the comments section. I'm out.